Praise the Lord. The Lord's name be praised. The Lord's name be praised. Praise the Lord. We are coming to the concluding stages of our sessions on identity, who we are and who we are not. And we've been dealing with God as our Father, identity. Now we've come to we are sons of God. I've established that God is our Father who art in heaven. Hallowed be thy name. So we are streaming the Super Champions Hour from the Holy Ghost Cathedral of the Jesus Kabod Ministry, JCM for short, formerly Jesus Glory Ministries. And the Kabod is the total glory of God, including the Shekinah glory of the Lord. That's the manifest presence of the glory of God, the dazzling splendor of God, the brilliant, the miracle, the pomp and pageantry, the rainbow and then the dazzling color of God. In concluding today, we we'll put it around three points. The first one is that we have Father God as our Father who has given birth in the Spirit, making us partakers of His divine nature. We are God's inside, princes of God. If we are partakers of His divine nature, then God has begotten birth to gods. That's why the Bible is said that, don't you know that ye are gods? We are gods inside. We have his nature. It is the Father God who has given birth to us through his living word, his seed, imperishable seed, incorruptible seed. And the Bible says his power, his eternal power has made us participators of his divine nature. If participate that, don't let it, this treasure be idle in your life. It must be active. You must put it to work. Everything God gives us, he gives it to us in the spirit and the natural, in raw material form. You have to refine it. You have to process it. You have to purify it. And you must put it to work. Number two, we have the crown prince, the Lord Jesus Christ, covering our back. <laughs> he said, you, there's nothing you can do. There's everything you can do because nothing is impossible to the Lord Jesus Christ. He's the vine. We are the branches. We abide in your business. Therefore, we bear much fruit. Without him, we can do nothing. But the Bible tells us in Philippians chapter 4, that we can do all things to Christ Jesus, who strengthens us, who infuses inner strength into us. We are self-sufficient in Christ's sufficiency. Now three. We are joint heads of the Father with the crown prince, King Jesus, of everything the Father is, has, and does. Listen, everything the Father is, his being, his persona, his very genes, his DNA, his chromosome, we are just like him. And everything he does, his power, ability, capability, we have the same authority and power. And we exercise the power through words and angels who excel in strength, the Bible says, minister and are swift to implement the commands of the Lord. When we speak, it's just like our Father and the Lord Jesus speaking. And they run to do it. And we have everything he has. He said the silver and gold are his. The cattle on the thousand and all of the hills are his. If he were hungry, he would not access. All things are ours. All things are yours, Mr. Christ. The natural, the gold, the silver, the everything. Angels are yours. Life is yours. Death is yours. The Bible tells us. The present is yours. The future is yours. Nothing is of our jurisdiction. Every blessing belongs to us as blood covenant, biological sons of God. Our sufficiency is of Christ Jesus. So we are going to look at the last scripture. I said by the inspiration of the Lord, He gives me more as I round up. Second Corinthians chapter three, from verse four to six. From verse four to six, our sufficiency is of Christ. You say you are not sufficient. That's why you think you don't have much money. You think you don't have a name. You don't have title. You don't have position. You haven't been to school. You don't have a university certificate. No, no. 
our sufficiency is of Christ. What does the scripture tell us? 2 Corinthians 3 from verse 4. And such trust have we through Christ to God's word. Our confidence is in Christ towards God. Not that we are sufficient of ourselves to think of anything as of ourselves. You see, our boast is not in us. In ourselves, we are insufficient. In ourselves, we have identity crisis. We have not. We cannot. And we are not. We are not. We cannot. And we have not. <laughs> but our sufficiency is not of ourselves. And for us to think of ourselves as being somebody uh, independent by ourselves. But our sufficiency is of God. That's what the Bible tells us in verse 5. Let's say it says, Who has also made us able, qualified ministers of the New Testament, not of the letter, not of the but of the Spirit, for the letter kills, but the Spirit gives life. We are not talking about natural inheritance and natural connection. Do you understand? We are talking about sufficiency that comes from the Most High. Elohim, Adonai, Yahweh, <laughs> El. Our sufficiency is of him through Christ. Christ is the all-sufficient one, the crown prince. And we are in union with Christ and union with the Father and union with the Holy Ghost. That's where our sufficiency, that's where our competence. And as it tells you, our competence is of God. Not that we are competent of it. We don't boast of us, we boast of Christ who is in us who is with us and who is us and we are him who is in us and we are him do you understand get a revelation let the holy spirit give you illumination of that we are no longer orphans in this life <laughs> what did jesus say i will not leave you at orphans i'll send the comfort that the holy spirit called the holy spirit to come and not only be with you he will be in you dwell in us so he that is in us is God, is greater than the problems and challenges of the world. We are no longer orphans in this life. Walk with God's fatherhood, sonship, consciousness every day, the rest of your life. Let me pray with you. Say, dear father. Dear father. My father. My father. My beloved father. My beloved father. Me as your beloved son. Me as your beloved son. I'm speaking to you. I'm speaking to you. In a loving relationship. In a loving relationship. I will always. I will always. Walk with the consciousness. Walk with the consciousness. That you have my back. That you have my back. You are my source. You are my source. My root. My root. My ancestry. My ancestry. You are. You are my beginning. My beginning. The all sufficient one. The all sufficient one. Nothing is impossible with you. Nothing is impossible you with you. You are omnipotent. You are omnipotent. Omnipresent. Omnipresent. Omniscient. Omniscient. Therefore. Therefore. Being hooked up with you. Being hooked up with you. Nothing. Nothing shall be impossible. Shall be impossible with me. With me, through Christ Jesus, through Christ Jesus, the Crown Prince, the Crown Prince, Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus, you so much love me, you so much love the me. Bible said, the Bible said, the Bible said, not that we love God, not, not that we love God, but He loves us first, but He loves us oh, first. Oh, the Father of love, oh, the Father of love, the family of faith, the family of faith, and the family of hope, and the family of hope. What a family. What a family. Right here in this world. Right here in this world. As well as in the world to come. As well as in the world to come. You are not a father who is irresponsible. You are not a father who is irresponsible. You are not a father who is insufficient. And you are not a father who is insufficient. You are not a father who is unfaithful. You are not a father who is unfaithful. You are faithful. You are faithful. Reliable. Reliable. Trustworthy. Trustworthy. Capable. Capable. Competent. Competent. Nothing. Nothing. Absolute nothing. Absolutely nothing. Shall be impossible unto you. Shall be impossible unto you. All things. All things. Are possible with you. Are possible with you. You call things. You call things. That be not. That be not. As though they were. As though they were. And you give life. And you give life. To the dead. To the dead. Because you are the resurrection. Because you are the resurrection. And the life. And the life. In me. In me. The Zoe life. Is the Zoe life. The resurrected life. The resurrected life. And the resurrected power. And the resurrected power. Authority. I'm not alone. 
I'm not alone. I cannot be alone. I cannot be alone. I'm one with you. I'm one with and you. And you are one with me. And you are one with me. I am you. I am you. And you are me. And you are me. I'm in you. I'm in you. And you are in me. And you are in me. I can. I can. Through Christ. Through Christ. Who infuses. Who infuses. In our strength. In our strength. And power. And power. In me. In me. I'm self-sufficient. I'm self-sufficient. In Christ's sufficiency. In Christ's sufficiency. Not in my own. Not in my own. I bless you, Lord. I bless you, Lord. Oh, thank God. God, thank God that you are the King of Kings, the King and of every kings. one of us, and every one of us, being citizen of your kingdom, happen to kingdom. be members of your royal family, happen to be members we of your royal family. We are sons, not slaves. Not slaves. We are sons. We are sons, not servants. Not servants. We are sons. We are sons. Not foster children. Not foster we children. We are sons. We are sons. Not stepchildren. Not stepchildren. We bless you. We bless you. Help us by the Holy Spirit. Help us by the to Holy Spirit. To exercise your dominion. To exercise your dominion. Of love. Of love. Faith. Faith and power and power in our household, in our household, in our community, in our community, in our schools, in our schools, in our place of work, in our place of work, in our nation, in our nation, and throughout the cosmos, and throughout the world. in Jesus' name. In Jesus name. We exercise authority from today. We exercise authority over Satan, over Satan, over devils, by over, devils over humans, over humans, over the plant. Over the plant, over the air, over the air, over the sea, over the sea, and the sea creatures, and the sea creatures. Heaven. Heaven and the earth and the earth in this present life and this present life and the world to come and the world to come we give you the praise we give you the praise Abba Abba Father Father now now have you solved have you solved our identity crisis our identity crisis inferiority inferiority the superiority complex inferiority complex will not fight people will not fight people will help them will help them will cancel them will cancel them will rebuke will rebuke but. But will not have a pity party. Will will not, not be envious. Will not greedy. Be envious. Greedy. Lying. Lying. And cheating. And cheating. For it's a family. For it's a family. Of purity. Of purity. Of faith. Of faith. Of sufficiency. Of sufficiency. Your name we pray. Your name we pray. Amen. 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 Oh, what a blessed life. Yeah. Know whom you are by knowing who is your source. God the Father. Through Christ Jesus. From henceforth walk with the fatherhood sonship reality confess it every day believe it act that way and you they not even the heavens can stop you it's only the throne of god which can limit you but he would not limit you for his throne is your throne jesus name we call it that and so i pray for you you haven't believed in jesus christ already you are an apostle, you are a prophet, but you don't know who you are. You walk and try to make a name and find something. And you go for private jet, you go for monies. They are good, but that is what you front about. And you let people see so that that covers it. They are all fig leaves. Do you understand? Some of us have put all our trust on metal things, metal, metal, like Belshazzar, eh? the, the, the son of King Nebuchadnezzar. They were worshipping the golden vessels and silver vessels and wood and everything and then and then worshipping them as gods. Right now, the the stronger the car, the metallic way, that's what they the limogini and whatever it is and V8 and the lights and we see speed cars and that's what we worship. That's not your identity. That's not your sufficiency. Your sufficiency is who gave birth to you, who is your source not natural man but the divine being god the father through his son jesus christ amen come home and those of you who haven't given your life to jesus say dear lord jesus dear lord jesus i've run around the world i've run around the trying world trying to find identity trying to find identity trying to find love trying to find love i've tried to make it i've tried to make it by getting money by getting money. by getting friends by getting friends the applause of people the applause of people but still but still, there's a vacuum in my life. There's a vacuum in my which life. Which cannot be filled. Which cannot be except filled. by you. Except by you. Come into my life. Come into my be life. Be my Lord. Be my Lord. And my Savior. And my, my Savior. Savior. Wash me. Wash me. With your precious blood. With your precious blood. Give me your life. Give me your life. life. Eternal life. Eternal I thank you. I thank for you. For bringing me back. For bringing me back. To my Father. 
to my father. As a prodigal son. As a prodigal son. He's not my father. He's not my father. He first loved me. He first loved me. I never knew. I, I never knew. knew. I surrender to his love. I surrender to his love. father. Abba Father, I surrender to your love. I surrender to your love. Your perfect love. Your perfect love. Cast away every fear. Cast away every fear. And I do not walk in fear. And I do not walk in fear. Fear brings torment. Fear brings torment. But love, but love, cast away, cast away every fear. Every fear. Your agape love. Your agape love. I thank you. I think in your name I pray. In your name I pray. Amen. Amen. Now that you are born again by receiving Jesus as your Lord and Savior, you do this. Daily spiritual exercise first. You keep God's word first place. You feed on the word of God. Have a quiet time. Exercise and, and draw away from everybody. You can have a prayer across it. Read your Bible every day. Feed on its food for your spirit. And give God's word first place and the final authority in your life. Not the words of men. Not the words of people on TV and radio. On the social media. Do you understand? Then the various mystery media around the world No. Then number two, pray to God. He's your father. You are his son. Don't be afraid. He will not drive you away. He wants you to come. Jesus has paid the price and made an access to the father to you. Always go in Jesus' name. Then number three, attend Bible believing church. Attend regularly and be a member of the church and actively participate in various departments according to your gift and calling and natural training. And then number four, you must of necessity draw people to Christ. Tell them about what Jesus has done for you. And let them also be saved and not go to hell. And let them be also children of God, solving their orphan spirit in Jesus' name. So this is the concluding session of our topic on our identity, sons of God. That is a sequence to our identity. God the Father. Until then. Until then. As we meet the next time. We I say shalom. The peace of God be with you. The joy of the Holy Ghost which is our strength. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. The love of God. And the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit. Be with you and with us all. In the matchless name of Jesus. Shout out.